soccer mom. You know, cute little nails. <gasps> she said that they can do walk-ins. I was like, okay, I'll be there shortly. <laughs> Welcome back to another vlog. You guys, I'm about to head out the door to go to the gym, but I actually have some time to spare. Um, so I wanted to sit here really quickly and just chat with you guys and talk about a few pieces that I got from Walmart. I'm wearing one of their cute little sets right now. Um, and I got a few other pieces that I want to show you. Thank you so much to the team at Walmart for sponsoring this portion of today's vlog. So you guys know I live in either loungewear or activewear or that's it. <laughs> um, so I did find a few cute pieces um, at Walmart that you can get online. You can also get it on the Walmart app because um, I know a lot of you use apps for literally everything. And you can get a lot of the pieces that I'm about to show you on the Walmart app. And sometimes when you go in the store, you have to like really look. Um, and I find that just shopping online or on the Walmart app, it makes it so much easier. So um, let me talk about the piece that I have on right now. I just threw this white um, sweater over because it's gonna rain today and I just needed something, you know, to cover up with because I don't have any sleeves on today. So the sports bra is from Avia and if you have been watching me for a while, you know, Every time I shop at Walmart, I at least have to get a sports bra because they have some of the best, best, best sports bras. So I wanted to get this style because I don't have this style. I like how it just, I don't know, it just fits really good at the top. It gives me really good support where I can, you know, run, hop up and down without, you know, the girls going everywhere. And the bottoms are actually a different brand. This is called Love and Sport. Y'all, these are so stretchy and so comfortable. So freaking comfortable so I thought it would just go perfectly with the um, sports bra that I have and a quick little tip for you guys if you just kind of want to elevate your look if you have on just you know like regular workout clothes like I have on today if you just want to elevate it just throw on a sweater over your shoulders and this just elevates it like it just it gives hold on where's the sleeve okay it gives I don't know soccer mom you know, going to, I don't know, pick up the fur babies from daycare. <laughs> it just elevates it. So yeah, anyway. Um, now if you're into more of the sports bra and short sets, y'all, they have some of the prettiest colors in this set. So this is by the brand Avia as well. Avia has like, y'all, I think all of my sports bras are from Avia. I think but this is the sports bra really pretty color I love this like what is it a periwinkle type of color and then the shorts super super comfortable they have like built-in shorts um, inside so you don't have to worry about you know the shorts flying up if you're doing anything intense like you know jumping up and down doing splits and stuff <laughs> Uh, but yeah, that's that one. And then I have my running errands type of outfit. So just some basic comfortable shorts because it is pretty hot and y'all these shorts have pockets. They have pockets. Very, very comfortable and soft, like super duper soft. So I got these and I got this um, body suit to go with it. The body suit is from the brand Madden NYC and the shorts are... Ah oh, man, I took the tag off the shorts because I've already worn these shorts. I haven't worn the bodysuit yet, but together they make the cutest, like simple little everyday running errands type of outfit. And then the last two items I got were actually like for real, for real necessity. Because I don't know what happened to all of my like basic tees. And I see Walmart has some of the softest V-neck basic tees. So I got a gray, I got the white, they have like five or six other colors, but I really wanted the gray and the white because I've had like shirts like this. I just don't know what happened to them. So I had to re-up on these. All right, y'all, we actually have, we still have a few minutes to spare before I actually have to walk out the door. Um, so let me show you what I'm keeping in my cute little everyday errands handbag. And this is also from Walmart. They have a really pretty like um, ivory color that I almost got. But I don't really have anything like, like I don't have this color 
in my um, wardrobe. So I said, let me just go ahead, you know, kind of step out of the box and get a purple handbag. So y'all, I like this thing because it carries a lot. Like you can hold, I can still fit my phone in here if I want to. But honestly, I don't put my phone in my handbag, no matter how big it is. I'm always carrying it in my hand. Um, but let me just quickly show you what I have in here. This Physicians Formula Diamond Plumper Gloss. I always get questions about this because I'm usually like randomly putting it on, especially on my TikTok. I'll just put it on and people are asking where it's from. You can get this from Walmart and I'm almost out. I need to get me another one. Look at that. We're almost out. Let me put a little bit on. Just a little bit. It's clear, but it has pink shimmer in it. Kind of gives that like pink pearlescent reflection on the lips. Pearlescent reflection. <laughs> anyway, I also keep my keys in here. Um, I keep a little mini fragrance in here as well. Always keep me like a little um, travel size fragrance in my bag. Hand sanitizer. Gotta keep our hands sanitized. I have, of course, my um, wallet and then another lip product. This is another like clear lip gloss slash lipstick product that I keep in here. And that's all that I keep in here. I wanna show you what it looks like on the inside. So there's like little slots, pockets in here that you can keep, uh, keep your cards if you don't wanna put your entire wallet. Um, down in there and I like that it's separated so one side you can put your essentials and then the other side you can have your phone or whatever else in there and it zips all the way around but yeah they also have a black one too if you don't want you know if you want something that can go with literally everything the black one is nice but like I said I wanted something a little different and you can remove these little um, straps too if you want but I just carry it as a um, crossbody and I love it it's so cute <laughs> okay now we have to go for real for real I'm gonna put all this stuff back in my purse but yes girl check out the Walmart app if you are interested in anything that I just shared with you and you can also um, shop these items on walmart.com but let's go because I don't want to be late for my class when I say they will start without me They've done that a few times. I've been late a couple times, so I just don't want to be late. I want to get there on time so I can start on time. So let's go. Okay, so I just did my nails, y'all. I was gonna film it, but I was filming it on my phone because I wanted to do like mini, you know, like mini content for my other platforms, but I just put them on. These are the ones I showed y'all in my last vlog. Now I just gotta um, moisturize the uh, cuticles. Now that I think about it, I think I wanna film that part as well, where I just put the balm on my cuticles yeah I'm gonna do that I'm gonna do that really quick but yeah I came home um after working out took a shower took the longest shower and I also washed my hair too because it was like really dirty so I needed to really wash it really good and it's still up in the top like I haven't done anything to my hair I just knew I wanted to come here and do my nails for the day because you know I just you know Holding products without nails, I just feel like it's just not, it, it just, it just, it, uh, I like, you know, cute little nails while I hold up products in my posts and stuff, but 
uh, let me film this part where I put on some of this um, beauty balm on my fingernails and then I will see what the footage looks like and yeah so I'm gonna let the battery charge because I don't have any other batteries that are charged that I got to do better I really have to do better y'all because I'd be leaving the batteries out instead of putting them on the charger so let me charge you guys up and then um, what else I need to do today Mm, 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 mm. I know I need to edit. I know that for sure. Um, I'm filming tomorrow for YouTube. Today is all about editing. I need to, um, I kind of want to film more like little small short film content. Um, I don't know. I'll see what the day, how the day turns out. But let me charge you guys up before y'all cut off. I'm going to use this pattern heat protectant um, to put in the hair. Do you guys um, take walk-ins or do I have to make an appointment? What do you want to do? Uh, just feed in braid. What do you want to do today? Um, can you do it today? Yes, we can do it today. Okay, yeah, that, that'll work. All right, thank you. You're welcome. All right, bye. Y'all, because I can't, y'all, like, I can't, I can't, this hair, I'm, I'm, I'm just like... I'm just gonna get it braided to the back. Cute little feed in braids. We're gonna see how it looks. But yeah, I, <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm gonna see if they can just braid my hair to the back. I've really been wanting French braids, uh, feed in French braids, because I think they're so cute for the summertime. Um, so I'm gonna see if they can do it. She said that they can do walk ins. I was like, <laughs> okay, I'll be there shortly. <laughs> 
You guys, wow. I feel like a whole new person. I haven't left yet, I'm still here. Um, that's why I still got my mask on, but I feel like a whole new person. Oh my gosh, yes. <sighs> so much better, so much better, y'all. I was having a little hair crisis, <laughs> but I was glad I was able to just come in here, like just do a walk-in and they do my head, y'all. These are so cute. Good morning. Today is filming day. Um, I'm not filming a makeup tutorial. Um, my face is gonna already be beat on the video. So I guess I'll just have you guys watch me get ready. Uh, but before I do that, I wanna clean um, my jewelry cause it's, I've been having to clean it. I had to take my bracelets off cause I started filming a little um, clip of something and I didn't really want my bracelets in the clip. So when I took the bracelets off, I was like, girl, these are really dirty. Like the clasps on them are really, really dirty because I never take them off. Um, so I'm about to do that really quick. I'm just gonna have them soak in um, some of this stuff that um, is from Pandora. This little cleaning solution. So I'm just gonna soak all of my bracelets, my ring, just the stuff that I wear like every day and rarely take off, which are my bracelets. Cause they're so hard to put on. That's why I keep them off. I mean, that's why I keep them on. Cause it's so hard to put them on. So it says you just drop them in here and let them soak for like 10 minutes. And I'm gonna do my ring too. And while that soak, let's go get ready. And if y'all are wondering how I wrap my hair, I just put the bandana on my braids. Let me show you. And then I put my bonnet on so that the braids don't get uh, frizzy. Cause this is like a satin bonnet. I didn't want my pigtails to get frizzy. So I did this, well, y'all can see how I just put my scarf on and then I put it up like this. I put both of the braids up like this and then I just put the bonnet on. And I will always love you. While those continue to soak, let's go put some makeup on. I'm using the Skin Proud sunscreen because I forgot to put on sunscreen before coming in here. And I just like to keep this one in my vanity. And this just melts like a butter, like a butter. No white cast, none, just glowy skin.
Okay, I am not doing foundation. I'm just doing concealer. And, and that's it. Well, concealer, powder, and bronzer today. I just wanted to do something simple. Nothing too crazy. Um, I need to get me another one of these e.l.f. concealers because I am running low. Y'all, I gotta pick up my, well, they haven't called me yet, but the, um, remember the pottery that I went to, to paint that, <clears throat> to paint the mug. So they said it takes about seven business days until it's ready. So they haven't called me yet. So I'm thinking it's going to be ready, um, sometime next week. So we'll go next week to pick it up. Um, I'm pretty sure it's going to look way better than what it did. I mean, it looked good when I painted it, but it's supposed to look like 10 times better once they, um, I forgot what you call it, but yeah. So when I pick it up, I'll take you guys with me. And, uh, yeah, yeah. When I looked at the footage, um, of me showing like the shelves with all the pottery and all that, I saw a mug that looked like a donut. And I can't believe I didn't see it like in person, but when I saw the footage of it, I was like, dang, I want that. I want to paint that because I've seen donut mugs before and I kind of want to go back and paint that one if they still have it. All right, I'm done. Hope y'all enjoyed hanging out with me yesterday and a little bit today, but I'm about to sit here and do some work. Um, and yeah, so I will see y'all later on.